Right, good afternoon, guys. Me, Steve here. You can see um, on Car Booty Steve. So, today I went to St. Helier's Car Boot Fair. Um, didn't get much today. There weren't that many vehicles there because uh, of the conditions of the weather. Um, but I picked up about uh, four or five cameras. Picked up a camcorder. Cut the CB radios and a little cut the bits of um, cutlery, not cutlery, uh, ornaments. So the first one I'm going to show you were these ones. These were the first ones I picked up. Um, this one has got a missing uh, little notch to it. It doesn't turn on because there's, the battery in this is completely flat. Um, it's taking these old ones. So I will test this one out later, uh, but for now I'm not going to test it out. Um, got a little loose inside that, I don't know what it is, but this one does turn on. The scorch works on it. But I'm not actually hearing any stations coming through. Breaker one nine, anyone copy? Oh, Breaker one nine, anyone copy? So, not getting no stations on that one. I don't know if these are actually working, to be honest with you. Um, I'm going to put, take the batteries out of this one and put them on that one later and see if that one works. Um, if they don't work, I will put them on eBay as spares, repairs. Someone might probably buy them as a um, collectible item. There are people out there who do collect CB radios, I believe. I just done a quick Google search to see if there was any of these on Google or YouTube or, um, well, not YouTube, sorry. I, I tried checking eBay and there weren't none on eBay. So um, those will be kept there for now. Uh, I'll probably eBay those later. Um, the ornaments, you can see I picked up a few little bits of ornaments. Uh, that one. That one, these were actually freebies actually from a store that was like wanting to go home. Um, so I picked these up. These will go into one of my mystery boxes, my ultimate mystery boxes. This one I might keep, try to clean it up. Nice little um, milk jug, but it does really need a good clean out. Or if I don't keep it, I'll probably, as I say, put in the um, mystery ornament box. Uh, this is a, could be used for sugar or, you know, biscuits, cookies or whatever. Or even flour. So, I'm not sure I'm going to keep that one. I might put it all into one box and just, like, get rid of them that way. So they'll all go outside in a little while. Uh, I'll probably try to give them a little rinse. Um, yeah, another little ornament, which is kind of broken at the bottom, but it's been kind of um, stuck together. And a little stuffed toy. There's all the three. Um, a couple of DVDs I picked up, but the thing was, there are no DVDs. In this one, there is a DVD, but it's not the DVD that's supposed to be with the Power Rangers. So that is a total waste. Uh, mind you, they were giving them away free anyway. Um, this one, no DVD, 
nothing in here at all. Uh, this one I've already got, but as it had been given away, I thought I'd grab it, you know, and keep it as a spare backup. I'm not sure of the condition on this one. It might be okay, it might be. Yeah, it's in fair nick. So, um, you know, when I do one of my mystery boxes, you know, mixed mystery boxes, I could probably shove that in there. Uh, I bought two of these Lumix or Lumix um, chargers. I'm using one at the moment, charging up the battery from one of the cameras. Uh, cut other cables I picked up. Um, a marriage blessing. Don't know why I picked that up. Um, camera wise. Uh, this one definitely works. I've tested it before I bought it. Got it for uh, about five, I think. Three, four quid, five quid, something like that. Um, that's all it comes with. It has got its manuals at the back by lots of things and a CD. Um, it's a, a brand I've not heard before. Uh, Practica. So all I've got to do is get some cables and a charger, stick it in the box and see what I can get for that. I'll uh, do some little kind of research on these later, see what they're worth. Um, I do do paranormal and I do mystery boxes for the paranormal. So what I'm thinking of doing is chucking a camera in a mystery box for the paranormal boxes. Um, I've got to test them out first to make sure they work. Um, they should work. I'm hoping they do work. But the thing is, I've got no chargers for them. So I need to get a universal charger uh, so I can start charging these up. I did pick up a few cameras the other day, uh, last week. I think I picked up about three or four last week. So what I'm really doing is just buying these and then chuck them in the old uh, mystery boxes and you know as long as they work that is if they ain't working then i'm just gonna have to like bin them but i think i've got some batteries like this i can uh try out anyway probably got a charger as well somewhere for some of these batteries so these ones i'm gonna have to like test out uh, another one, another Lumix. I actually got two Lumixes from the same guy. Uh, two for 10 quid. I just hope they work. One of them had a 4 gig memory card, which I'm going to check out if there's anything on there. Uh, as I say, I'm ch charging up the battery now. Um, I don't think there's going to be enough energy. Oh, hang on, it just turned on. So, yeah, that works. Got a bit of um, liquid damage there by looks of things. But, uh, you know, it, it is working. So let's try the other one. Because they were sitting out in the rain, in the rain as well. Yeah, that one works as well. So two cameras, that definitely work. I just got to get another battery for this one. Cut the chargers, then they can go into mystery boxes. Um, I picked up a VCR. That other stuff over there is my own personal stuff, which I've had for ages. There's nothing I bought from a car booty. Apart from I did get this cable, which is like micro. Um, micro SD to HDMI uh, this one I picked up not sure it was going to work it has got a tape in there um, I'm going to try and find if I've got some way of connecting this up to the mains I think I might have a, a power supply similar to this one I'm not sure it's in pretty good condition it's got night vision on there as well uh, the guy wanted a bit 
more money than I was expecting them to pay out, but we did come to an arrangement on the cost. Um, but as I say, there is definitely a tape in there, I can see it. So I want to try to get this powered up and uh, connect it to the TV properly and see what's on there. Uh, the only thing is I'm not sure I've got a cable that will fit this onto the TV. I might have, I don't know. Well, I could probably connect it to the... Um, yeah, I think I can connect it to the computer, actually. I don't know if I can actually charge this up with the actual cable I've got, but there might be a possibility I can charge it up. Um, but I'll have to wait to see, actually, find out. Um, let me see if I've got cable. Uh, for a minute. I know I've picked up a couple of cables. <sighs> so that's a cable for it there. I'm not saying it's going to work, but it might work. So. Turn this one on. No, I think I might have to wait for it to charge up a little bit actually, but um, we'll see how that goes. So we're going to try to charge it up somehow. Um, I think the way that's, that's doing it at the moment is it's not going to charge up with that cable. Um, I can use the cable to pull it through the actual PC and possibly um, run the actual tape for the computer. I don't, there might be, I might need a different cable um, to run it, I don't know. There weren't no instructions or anything, you know, it's just as it was. So I'm hoping I might be able to charge this up and uh, somehow copy the tape content onto the computer and then somehow format the tape. So if I get to sell that one, um, I'll put this tape with it and I'll also put another tape on, another tape in and set it with two tapes. If I've got a power supply, um, I may stick the power supply in and so I can sell it for about 30, 40 pound. I will probably have to get another power supply for the one I've got anyway. But uh, I'll have to see how that goes. Uh, it might be a possibility that I can get that working, but there's a big possibility it might not work. But that's what I picked up today. Um, these I'm going to do some research on. Um, going to take the batteries out of this one and put them in this one and see if this one works. There is something slightly kind of loose in here, I think. What that is, I don't know. But I will give this a quick test out as well. Um, and see if that works. Yeah, I'd like to have one of these if it's working to talk to the old CBS out there, but it don't seem like I'm picking up any stations on there at the moment, especially on that one. But never know with that one. It might work. It might not. not it might not work. If I can't get them to work and pick up many stations. I'll just dump one on eBay for uh, 15, 20 quid or something, you know. There'll probably be someone who can repair them um, or someone might want them in their own, like, um, CB collection, maybe. I don't know. But anyway, that's it for today. Uh, the video will be up uh, for car boot fair later on. Carts in the hundreds. Wouldn't be worth a hundred. No, <clears throat> that one does turn on. And I thought this video... Sorry, I thought this video was private, actually, but never mind. Um, this this actual video is actually coming off this channel and going on my other channel in a minute. Um, it does turn on, you know, as you can hear. But I'm not picking those stations up. 
So uh, it was more of a risk buying them anyway. So, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll probably stick them up for about 20 quid. Um, at least I'll get a little bit more money than I'll pay for them anyway. They're not really worth much. Um, if I can get this working, this camcorder working, uh, then, as I say, I'll, I'll format that tape in there. And I'll also put a spare tape, because I think I've got to cut spare tape for it. And um, order a power supply the charger, and then knock that for about 30, 40 quid, I think. Maybe less. I don't know. I'm going to have to find how much these are worth. Um, that's if it works. It might not even work. Uh, I'm hoping it does. But at least, at least uh, the loom axes are working. Uh, so I need to get another battery for one of these ones. Um, and charges for those and then I can stick them in my little mystery boxes which I do on eBay uh, for paranormal um, though I might just sell them as they are separately I don't know yet I'll just have to work it out later but I've got to find a way of charging these ones up as well I know that one works the pink one. Uh, I don't think this one works. I don't know. I know there's supposed to be another one which took um, different batteries, but I don't think I picked that one up. Oh, yeah, I did. No, there was one which took um, the AA batteries, you know, the smaller batteries. Um, the smaller one of those ones, yeah, it takes two of those, and I kept trying to charge, you know, because I take batteries with me, and, you know, I tried it all different ways, and it didn't work, so I didn't bother with that one, I'm not going to buy a camera that doesn't work, but I say that, these three may not even work, I've got to find a way of charging those up, but I know those three work, so, um, as I say, I probably, I might sell them separately or I might actually put them in mystery boxes with some other bits and pieces no I don't know anyway cheers for watching and I'll catch you later